In the land of Mordor, where the shadows lie. It was here, on the slopes of Mount Doom, that the Dark Lord Sauron was defeated by the last alliance of men and elves. It is here that for two and a half thousand years the rangers of Gondor stood watch, guarding against a nameless threat they had all forgotten. And while the strength of Gondor faded, the power of the malice of Sauron grew in darkness. He has returned to Mordor. Swing. We're killing chicken. Wouldn't want to hurt you. Could take a lot more than that. <laughs> Dear Hyle, the mighty chicken killer. Come on. Come on. Show your father what you have, huh? Come on, boy. You'll have to hit harder if you want to best your father. What? Hard enough? Not quite. Parry, son. Don't forget to block. Perhaps you should not forget to hit. Stay alert, dear. All right, say so. The enemy will not always be as he appears. Come on. Come on. Oh. There you go. Easy, son. You're not a soldier yet. I'll have your Hold on!
sculpture like these. Who? <laughs> the what? Happy anniversary, mother. Alien. This is beautiful. Where did you find it? I still have a few friends left in Gondor. Did you talk to my father? Yes, I did. And nothing has changed. He's still very stubborn. I say we go anyway. The I will not come willingly. There must be a better life than this. Not now. But soon. I'm just so tired of hiding here, Italian. We must hide now, or we are both dead. Stop feasting. Where do you go? Oh, there he is. There he is. Put the sword down, Ranger. You're an ugly one. Now, do you believe me, Ranger? What has happened to me? You are banished from death. Cast adrift between the worlds of light and dark. Curse binds us together within the walls of Arda. If what you say is true, then how do we break this curse? We find the one who cast it on us. The Black Hand of Sauron.
Italian killed a nobleman, Yorith. His life now belongs to Gondor. Unlocked. Unlocking Forge Towers unlocks the Wraith's memories. This unlocks new missions, collectible locations on the map, and Mirin. Mirin. Okay, so the Wraith has lost its memories. Hold A to move forward. One of you at Narcos, eh? An easy mistake to fix. What? No objective. Hold LT to enter range mode. RT to charge your shot. You will suffer for what you've done! Whoa, Rafe stun. Oh, tap. These are the captains of Samhain's army. They appear as shadows because you don't know their yet their identity. By interrogating enemies, you can uncover valuable information about these captains. Press A to learn the identity of this captain. You have learned Ginub's identity. This will help you hunt him down. His title, the slaver, gives you clues about his role in Uruk's society. You have also learned his power rating. This gives you an indication of how difficult he will be to defeat. The power rating also determines your rewards for defeating him. Rewards include runes to upgrade your weapons and increasing your own power to unlock new ability tiers. The veteran captain. Target located at the main mission. The map and objective show you where the captain can be located. Motive. Hoping the slave tries to escape soon. Wanting to make an example. That's sick. Disgusting. Uh, press A to mark your target. Okay. That is where we have to go. If we can trust a book, trust has nothing to do with it. His thoughts cannot lie. Missions. Gold icons advance the story, red icons display power struggles where Uruks compete for status. They're competing against each other. Reward power to unlock new ability tiers. White icons represent side missions collectibles. Reward Mirin to purchase upgrades. Okay, you have two available side missions. The Slaver, save the humans trapped. Uh, oh, main mission, sorry. Save the humans trapped in Mordor and fight the black captains. The spirit of Mordor. Learn more about Uruk society and take on Sans armor from it. Okay. These coins are minted by elven smiths of Aragorn, Erechon, and Mirin. Bec 
became the currency of that realm, prized throughout Middle Earth. As with the Ifaldin Star Moon, with which they marked their doors, Mirin was brought from Mithril, which they traded with Dwarf Swarm. The currency would commonly be traded between the races at locations such as the market of Khazadun. To honor the dwarves, Mirian pieces featured Durin's door on one side and Scrape Forge on the other. In the Second Age, the Dark Lord Sawan relentlessly sought the destruction of Mirian, and now the coins are seemingly are supremely rare relics of a long dead kingdom. So they're expensive. Mordor, a land of shadow and home of the second Dark Lord of Middle Earth, Sauron. Sauron, the first Dark Lord. Uh, Mordor beckons to the spirits and calls dark things to its twisted heart. It is home to many monstrous creatures, among them Karagors, Groks, and Ungol. Monsters neither the Uruks nor the Dark Lord have tamed. Its burning heart, Ordrin, currently lays dormant. It has been still for thousands of years. Sauron's fortress, Baradur, has been fully raised, and its cloak and is cloaked from the sight by a dark shroud. Okay. The Uruks have seized all of Mordor from the Black Gate to Nurn hundreds of miles to the south. Many innocent people have been trapped with little hope to escape. Morinon. The Black Gate of Mordor is a formidable defensive structure that spans the gap between Mordor's arid Lidui, Ash Mountains, and the uh, Ephel Dwarf, Shadow, Mountain of Shadow. It has alternately protected, alternately protected Mordor from Gondorian invasion and Gondor from Mordor. Its walls are built of stone and are impregnable. The magnificent structure was created during the Second Age by the Dark Lord Sauron's forces using the power of the One Ring. The later, after Sauron's defeat at the Battle of Thagralad, Gondorians used prison labor to construct the towers of the Teeth, Narkost, and Karkost on either side of the Great Wall. Rangers of Gondor manned the gate for over 200 years, but their numbers have declined dramatically since the Great Plague. Udun. Udun. The Valley of Udun is a harsh and an accommodating land used primarily as a way station for armies with ambitions to breach Mordor or attack from it. The sprawling lands was once populated by Gondorian outcasts, but is now commanded by the Uruks. Udun is bounded by the Black Gate in the north and the Iron Jaws of Karach Angen Ang Ang to the south, def defended by the reoccupied stronghold Dortog, and cut by the, the imposing Black Road leading to the fortress ruins of Baradur, where Dark Lord has retreated after his defeat by the White Council at Dol Gador. Ordrun, Benor's Mount Doom, is the greatest volcano in Middle Earth and is the fiery heart of Sauron's realm. It was in Samoth Noir, chambers of fire within the mountain that Sauron forged a one ring to dominate all of Middle Earth, and this is the only place where it can be unmade. Orodrin has been dormant since the One Ring has cut, was cut from Sauron's hand on its very slopes. It will once more burst into flame when Sauron has built his power in the ruins of Barador. Barador, the Dark Tower, has lain in ruins since it was cast down by Gondor after Sauron's defeat at the end of the Second Age. However, as long as Sauron survives, the foundations of Barador can never be destroyed. It is to these ruins that Sauron has re retreated since his return to Mordor. But hidden behind a sorcerer's veil, he has begun to rebuild his power for the Great War of the Ring to come. Okay. So that's about Sauron's army, weapons, and runes. Runes available. I have runes. Flame of Anor. 20%. Critical hits with the sword will ignite enemies and the blade's flames grow orange. So I can place these runes into my sword and they'll... What? Add these effects. 20% chance of critical hits with the sword will ignite enemies and the blade's flames grow orange. Orc Slayer. Combat finishers do extra damage against campins. Rising Storm. Grant access to the storm of Ulfogo legendary weapon power. Elven Grace, 50% chance to reduce melee damage, received by 50%. No, does not stack with another Elven Grace rune. 
defiant to the end. Never surrender as you gain additional last chance to re return to the fray in combat against the rooks. Ooh. Okay, that seems the most useful. Or fail. Never surrender as you gain an additional last chance to- oh, this is the- Okay. Wait. Ah, bow. Okay. The bow ruins are- Ascendant reduces the focus depletion rate by 50%. Deadly Archer increases headshot damage by 25%. Probably focus depletion? Right? I'm guessing. And then that's for my dagger. Dagger ruins. Gravewalker epic. Increases the moral morale effect on enemies when they witness a captain die. Or hunter. Brutalized stealth kills causes additional terror. A hidden blade. Stealth kill and ground executions deal extra damage to captains and war chiefs. One with nature. Immune to poison. Oh. That's probably, you know, good. Either a hidden blade or one with nature. Let's go with one with nature. I'd rather not get poisoned. Okay. Upgrades. Earn XP to gain ability points and unlock powerful new abilities. To power store goal to earn power more quickly and unlock ability tiers. Okay. Worry about that later. Appendices. People. Italian. A Gondorian ranger, Italian was slaughtered on the Black Gate along with his wife, Lorif, and his son, Dirio. Uh, Italian did not find peace in death. However, he was cursed and resurrected by a powerful wraith who was possessed his body and reforged him as an undying spirit of vengeance. Italian's swordsmanship, speed, resistance, and training have all been augmented by the wraith's presence within him, as though he himself possessed the power of one of the great rings. He can view the unseen world, lay his hands on foes, and exploit their fears or dominate their wills, making him a monster to monsters. Talion is bound to Mordor, doomed to reside there until he can destroy the black captains who murdered his family and the face the Dark Lord who commands them. Lorif was Talion's wife, Daryl's mother, and Halas's daughter. She was born and raised in Minas Tirith, where her father was a guard of the Citadel. When she was 19, she and Italian fled Gondor together to build a new life on the frontier of the kingdom. Okay. She was killed, along with her family, by the Black Hand when Sauron returned to Mordor. Hmm. Okay. Thurhael was Italian's and heir of son, born and raised on the Black Gate. Thurhael wanted nothing more than to be a ranger like his father and his grandfather before him. It was not to be, he was killed along with his parents by the Black Hand. Rangers of the Black Gate. Don Gondor, Gondor controlled the Black Gate for over two millennia after Sauron's defeat, with the rangers keeping watch over Mordor. The rangers supervised the building of the Towers of the Teeth, standing guard over Gondorian prisoners who would later escape into Udin and settle there. Over the centuries, the rangers suffered greatly, their numbers whittled down by the Great Plague and an invasion by the Easterlings. Eventually, a small but hardened crew stood to man the watch, a brave few who were quickly overwhelmed when Sauron returned. Wraiths. There are many restless, restless spirits with the Middle-earth who have not been able to find peace in death. Whites, wraiths, and ghosts of terror, Sauron the Necromancer calls to them all within the border of Mordor. Should he rebuild his power and be able to command his, this lost army of dead, he will be unstoppable. Uruks, the Great Orcs. The Uruk is the elite of all orc breeds. They are grown in huge vats as a leadership cast and are taller, stronger, better able to withstand daylight, and more ill-tempered than the lesser orcs. They are captains and commanders, bred for war and determined to take back their homeland for the Dark Lord Sauron. They impose their will with brute force, they hate beautiful things, will not admit to any fears, revel in slaughter, and enslave any who stand in their path. They are certain the Dark Lord has returned to lead them to their destiny as rulers of Middle-earth. The Hammer of Sauron The Hammer was once a man, a stretcher-bearer for Gondor, dedicated to retrieving the wounded. His life changed on the slopes of Mount Doom when he retrieved Sauron's mace after the Dark Lord fell. Okay. Stretcher bearer for Gondor. When he took up the weapon of Sauron, he realized that his life had been wasted in saving others who sought glory in war. 
If men wished to be Daglorosi in battle, he would grant their wish with pleasure. He became doomed to a bloodlust that would never be sated. He has waited millennia for Darko's return to go on Mordor, and now his purpose has been revealed to him. So he's been alive for that long? Holy crap. Okay. That's just possessed, basically, by the, the mace, Tower of Sauron. As the tower's evil has grown, so has his nature, stature. He is trapped inside armor that will not grow with him. Okay. And his agony is exquisite. He has once... He was once a... Numenarian. And he, had, he as you can recall, he has either built a tower or was once locked inside one. His appearance is horrific. To stand near him is to feel the revulsion he feels for himself. Even his fellow captains despise the tower, although they have come to rely on his great corrupting evil. His propensity for slaughter is unmatched. He makes this. His victims feel his pain, and he revels in it. Yeah, he does look like he's in pain. Why has he been put in in this armor? Did Sauron put him there? The Black Hand of Sauron. The Black Hand is the greatest and most feared of the Black Captains. His mere presence on the battlefield spreads terror among his foes and servants alike. Some say he was once a great king from the east who brought Sauron the heads of two Istari as gifts. Others say that he returned across the seas with Sauron after the fall of Numenor. Still others claim that he is the Dark Lord himself, once again taking fair form within Mordor. There are many stories of his origins, all of them are lies. The only things which are certain are that he is the master of the sea, and that he serves his Dark Lord with absolute loyalty. Talons of the Black Hand The Talons are the elite personal guard of the Black Hand of Sauron. The Black Hand was schooled in sorcerous arts at the side of the Necromancer, and he personally draws forth the Talons from their spawning vats at Barad-dûr. They are tested in battle immediately after they are dragged, screaming into a world of anger, hatred, and fury. There are always five talons, and whenever one falls in battle, his body is returned to the vats where his death can feed the creation of his successor. If his corpse cannot be successfully carried back to Barador, then the remaining talons are sacrificed in his steed. Okay. We covered the lore tutorial. Tap Y to counter. Sometimes two enemies will strike at you simultaneously. Press Y twice to counter both attacks at the same time. While poisoned, counter prompts will be hidden, but you can still counter with Y. Uh, red attacks cannot be countered. Tap A to dodge. Okay. To our ground execution. Some ruins and overboards for ground execution. Normal attacks miss knockdown enemies. Use ground executions to finish these enemies off. Hold R and tap T to kill drowned Caragors. Uh, stealth finisher, unlock and events finishers to abilities. Missions, we cover that. Okay. Alright. We have a new mission. The world has changed. Nothing makes sense. Nothing has changed. This is how it will be. The future and the past are linked in darkness. I don't understand why I'm here. And I can't remember. So this is the tower that's in front of me. That was forged by the Wraith. And this is an artifact. And we want to go... Where? Over here. Right, we want to get to the slavers, so we would go this way. And I kind of want to see what this is. Survival challenge. Remember, let's go find the slaver. His mind may provide answers. Enter go. the Wraith world to Come find a well, nearby Ithlidin. He's blind in one eye. In track, oh. Probably just a couple of spiders. So they're right here. Okay, so we want to probably s a grave walker problem. Okay. All right. 
those three of them. Dreyborn told me his category was tight. Dreyborn does nothing but lie. You can't tame a category. <laughs> I don't know, did you? The icon above Oryx said this place is awareness. Yellow indicates an Oryx investigating the disturbance. Red indicates that Oryx is aware of you. Hold RT to sneak, reducing the amount of noise you make. Unlock ability. You got ability points. Uh, execution. When you when your hit streak is charged. Press Y and P to uh, execute your target. Okay. Uh, history chart. Every X8 consecutive hits, the hit counter, history counter will turn red and your sword will glow. Okay. Versus impact. Counter enemies will be knocked backwards, stunned, or knocked down. Strike them above. Ooh, that sounds fun. AL takedowns. R, RT and X on the unaware targets become lethal. Elven swiftness. When you're landing, tap A when mantling over obstacles to gain temporary speed boots. Ooh, that sounds fun. Detonate, shoot fire or barrels to cause them to explode. Oh, Rave Stun. Already, we already have that. Uh, stun enemies, tap B, then follow with the flurry. Okay. And then this is Ride Karagors. Press RB to mount Karagors from above. Once mounted, you can ride climbing. Ooh, that sounds fun. But I'm going to go from the strike with above. That sounds exciting. Yes. Because so I could have done that here, but I didn't know I could. Appendices. We have a new one? Oh, it's more hints. Awareness. Right. So if I tap B, then I can do some Wraith Strikes. All right. Now, enter the Wraith world. Whoa, what's that? I saw like a... Oh. Goroth. To learn his details, you must find intel or interrogate another captain. Okay. Uh. So we have to interrogate, where, where is he? Did it tell me? Is it this guy? No. Uh. No. Is it this guy? Where is he again? He's over there. Gone off. If I mark target. Few details. Oh, he's a captain. Okay. So realizing he'll be dead if he doesn't get promoted soon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. So we need to grab intel. Oh, what? There's another one? Ratbag the Coward. Fear of grogs. Become terrified of the sight of grogs. Uh, fear of ghouls. Become terrified of the sight of ghouls. Fear of... He fears a lot of things. Feeling like he deserves much more respect. Okay. Well, I guess we're targeting this guy now. Because he's the closest one. And we need to learn about him. Oh, he's right there. Okay. What was this? If we didn't... What is that? Okay. Best weather for a good battle is what the men don't call the bag. So I can run like that. If I run like this. And why is standing around waiting for some blood thing? So enter range mode. This will enter Wraith World. It's RP do grabs, right? How do I jump? Yeah, how do I jump? How do I... Can I not? Oh, 
I guess I can't. Alright. I see someone. What is this? Nani here, Galar Mordor. Okay. That's something. Ifildin. Ifildin, also called Star Moon, are ancient symbols that can be found carved into the living stone and ruins of Mordor. They are relics of an ancient kingdom, invisible to all but the Wraith, who can see into the unseen world. The Wraith with Dintalion can view and activate these symbols of power. More to the point, he feels a distant connection with them. They are relics of his past. So he's connected to these. Like he's from? These are Ifildin, Star Moon, forged of Mithril. They hold memories of the ancient past. The knowledge past? within may be fair or ill. Don't see anyone else? Shh, don't say anything. Hey, you're free to go. How you doing? Last few kills didn't bleed enough. I can run while sneaking, okay. We should interrogate. But I don't I forgot, I just kinda killed the guy. I probably shouldn't have done that. I can survive anything. Include the grave. Stealth kill. I don't want to drop to hang. Drop. Uh oh. I only need one of you. It looks like I'm going to need you. Brought up corruptor. Now you'll all pay. Oh, you're new. I'll deal with you later. I'm gonna need some information. How do I how do I get information? How do I interrogate? What is going on? What is this doing? I just wanna interrogate him. Lori is out first, okay. Even lower? Hate of pain. The hell is that? Oh crap. Did he gain back health? How the hell did he do that? Can't grab you yet? No. All right. You say so. Really? Still? How much do I have to... 
Uh, I've been here causing bother for years. Not anymore. I'll deal with you later. Oh, come on. Shit, shit, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Am I supposed to... Crap, this is not good. How am I supposed to get out of this situation? Collect herbs? Okay, well, I don't see any herbs. I gotta get rid of this guy. Because he can attack from afar. Come on. Now's not the time. This is all too much bother. You buy next time. That works. I need to take care of you. Last struggle, last chance struggle. Use L to move the cursor into the circle, then press the display button to counter attack, okay? <laughs> Woo! We're back! Crap. Yeah, I don't have time for for the scar artists. Come on, just let me. Take care of this guy. He just will not go down. Alright. Come on. I just need some time alone with you. That's a break your guard, huh? Can I grab you now? Really? Not yet? Do you? Oh, I really wanted to interrogate you. Oh, wow. Threat log the corruptor. He was killed. When captains are killed, an open position is created in Sarwan's army. New captains can move in to fill his position when time passes. Crap. It's gonna be a never-ending battle then. Wait, where is... Is this the Scar, dude? No, that's the Coward. Where's the Scar? It's this guy. That's the guy we wanted to get. R to pick up. It's a rune. Chance to recover 30% focus for a headshot kill. Yeah, we need to collect herbs. What the hell are these herbs? Runes. Behold the runes. Elvis Smith's the tale their great deeds and commemorate the triumphs of long dead warriors with these enigmatic and powerful markings. 
The Smiths employ arcane craft to create their runes, recording the final fate of their enemies with the metallic compound if Ifildim and attaching them to their armor, blades, and great bows. In this way, the elves create and cast a unique legend for their fabled weapons. This legend will grow with each deed. The Uruks will come to know weapons adorned by them in name as they are glamdering and orchurst. As they have glamdering and orchurst. And to fear its great powers. Okay, so Glamdering and Orcus are like examples of weapons. And we have got a bow weapon. And this one is 30% chance to recover 30%, 30 plus 3 focus for a headshot kill. Yeah, it's still right. I have the less depletion. Upgrades. You have enough Mirian to purchase an upgrade. Pressing RT on this ability will show you its ability. Attributes. Oh. Mirian is the currency to upgrade your weapons and increase your maximum health focus and elf shot. Okay. Earn Mirian to find collectibles, including side missions, challenges, bonus objectives. Okay, so I have 75 Mirian. What can I afford? I can afford this sword rune slot. Okay. Are you sure you want to spend? Sure. Why not? So now we have an extra sword rune slot. So if we go to the sword. Go ahead. Okay. So we can change this one. Elven Grace. Uh, there's a chance of melee damage received by. Does not stack. 20% chance of critical hits with the sword will ignite enemies and blades grow orange. That sounds fun. Orc Slayer. Combat finishes do extra damage against captains. Grants access to Storm of Urfil legendary weapon power. Okay, let's try that one. I have no idea what that does. Stat summary. Never run surrender as you gain additional last chance to earn the freight. Oh, that's okay. Uh, appendices. What's new? Uruk, the captains. Uruk captains. Uruk captains oversee Sauron's army. They enforce construction and demolition projects, craft battle plans, and administer discipline to their underlings. The Uruk hierarchy is competitive. Captains win their place by slaughtering those above them and keep power. Does that mean I'm a captain? Now that I've slaughtered one? And keep power by destroying underlings who might possess or pest. Oppose them. This ensures endless competition among the Uruks and winning the rank of captain means an Uruk is one of the strongest, deadliest, and most devious of their kind. As a weapon, as a measure of their status, captains often carry the best weapons and armor peered from the corpses of the foes they have killed and bear the scars from the battles they have fought. Oh, there's more. What else have we learned? Oh, I have to go one by one? Fantastic. Oh, herbs. So, uh, click herbs to restore health. View the map for survival challenges to earn Mirian. You can see the herbs grow in an area by looking at the map after unlocking a forge a tower. Oh, okay. You can increase your max health by purchasing upgrades. Your health will only partially regenerate after battle. Herbs since in the ruins will restore lost health. There's still more? Alright. Uh, what else? Last chance struggle. Okay. So we need herbs right now. Uh, I don't see herbs. What is this? Oh, this is Gorov Stronghold. He was he was in a not where I expect him to be, but I guess that's where he ran a read to. Um, right. We need herbs, and this will not show me herbs. So, what are our options right now? Mithril Blade, a flash of silver lightning carved his way through the Dark Lord's ranks. Each foe had his life stolen away from before into it. Forge the legend of the dagger, Ankrum. That looks like it could be helpful, I think. Right? Let's go there. Is that a cage? Hold on. What the hell is that? Oh crap. Let's 
kill this son of a bitch. Or let's interrogate him. Can we do that? How do we do that? Yeah, take him down. Did I not gain information? How do I interrogate? How do I do that? Right, the cage. Nothing in here. Anyway, we should go this way. Uh oh. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Now's our best chance. It is, run. Thank you. Yeah, I need herbs, I need herbs. There's another one. Oh, there's a whole group over there. Whoa. Can I climb? How do I climb? Ah, okay. Where's this guy? Oh, uh oh. There's a lot of them. Okay. Just you? I think I can kill you from above, right? Because I learned that ability. Slung the walls. Whoops. Okay. Oh, here's one. Get an ability point. Uh, what can we spend it on? We already have this. Alright. Elven swiftness. When I vault over obstacles. Okay. Sure. Crap, there's a lot of them. Just you wait. We're gonna be getting all. The Mithril Blade, a flash of silver lightning carving his way through the Dark Lord's paths. Each foe, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm the Mithril Blade. Each foe has his life stolen away from before he went. Forge the legend of the dagger, Ahram. Oh, I can sneak. Hold A to run while sneaking. Stealth kills in three minutes. Okay. So the forge, that's how it. You say something, slave? If I hear so much as you breathe it. I'll chop off your legs and make you do ten laps around camp! Oh, you're really horny for some corporal punish corporal punishment. Thank you. Shh, it's okay. Don't worry about it. Don't mention it. Don't mention it. Don't say anything, actually. <laughs> Yeah, don't notice me at all. You guys are really bad with your ears. Worms will expose a captain's weakness when interrogated. What the hell is a worm? What the hell is a worm? I just jump across. Today it'd be a hell of a lot easier with more grog. Grog? You That's disgusting. I heard you want more grog. Oh, oh. 
Oh, yeah, you said Grog. I thought you meant stab you in the head. My bad. No, it didn't. It says I don't need your foul stench near me. I can do considering you know they killed and slaughtered my entire fucking family <laughs> mithril base success mission complete plus one xp Next objective bonus what was my bonus weapons upgrade complete those side missions and other side missions to earn miriam Earn enough, and you will be able to purchase definitely stronger ability for your dagger. The shadow of ah Ahran, ah Ahan, 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 will allow you to disappear for a short time, enabling unlimited stealth kills. Whoa! What? I'm sorry. Did you say unlimited stealth kills? Attributes. Oh, I can buy stuff now. Is it this thing? No, it's dagger ruin slot. This is a bow ruin slot. This is a max focus up. Increase your maximum focus by increase your maximum health. Ooh, I like that one a lot. Yes, more health, please. And I'll take a dagger slot. Why not? Abilities. Hmm. I haven't seen a category yet, so. Fires. Okay. This might come in handy. Impact. Counter enemies we knock backwards. Yeah, I'm gonna see the detonate. I'm hoping that'll come in handy. And now put the rune on my dagger. Let's see. Gravewalker increases the morale effect. When you witness a captain die, or hunter, brutalized stealth kills to cause additional terror. Hidden blades, stealth kill and ground execution deal extra damage. Let's see with that one. And I'm guessing it's a tutorial entry in here. Yeah. Oh. Worms. Okay, what the fuck's a worm? Worms will expose a captain's weakness when interrogated. Hints and tips. Worms and insult pickups are visible on main map and mini map. Uh, captains are much stronger than regular orcs. Gain intel and review their details to find a weakness and plan a strategy. So I can only in get any intel from worms. Okay. I was trying to interrogate people who were not interrogable. Using Captain Spheres against him will disable many of his strengths and weaknesses, making it much easier to defeat. You cannot exploit the weaknesses of one base until you gain intel. Okay. Alright. Cool. So we're looking for worms. Oh, someone coming? Will you? Oh, shit. I see a worm. Gotta save these slaves. You gotta save for later. Oh, there's a lot of them. You know, maybe I should have shot from a far away. I forget I could do that. Just gotta make sure not to kill the worm. I'm not really sneaking. 
I'm kind of right in front of you. On. Oh, sorry, my bad. I need to keep you alive. Maybe killing all these guys will scare you into talking. Don't fucking last much longer. Be careful. Shit, 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 shit. I can make sure I survive and also not kill the worm. It's kind of hard to do. Damn it. Ah. Can't believe I killed the worm. Maybe taking these guys on was a bad idea. But, oh, there's another one. Fantastic. There's just so many of them. Ooh. Oh my god. This is just brutal. I'll just let you two? Great. How do I interrogate you? That didn't interrogate you. I still don't know how to interrogate people. So that's that's great. Oh, there's another worm. Okay. Intel. Oh, I grab Intel. I grab Intel? I'm confused. Oh, I can grab Intel out other than from the worms. Gotcha. Okay. Intel will reveal Captain's weaknesses, strengths, weaknesses. Okay, cool. Uh, right, Intel. Scar artist. He is vulnerable to combat finishers, vulnerable to ranged attacks. Okay. Can be killed by a single charged headshot. Oh, shit. Fire or shadow strike. Clumsy. Can be grabbed without requiring low health. Ooh. Vulnerable to mounted beasts. Can be killed instantly by mountain beast finishers. Hate of his rival. Becomes a rage near unknown captain. Oh. So. Okay. Alright. So put those two captains together and they'll fight each other. Is that a herb? Finally. Phew. Alright. Click herbs to restore health. Real challenges. Okay. Challenges make us stronger. There's an artifact over here. Probably a good idea to go over there. Ooh. What's this blue herb over here? There's just different levels of restore health. That's a rod on. Known as known to most as Ozerodon or Blue Mist, this rooted plant grows tall, hail, hail and harfy across Middle Earth. Its persistent growth 
and resistance to all attempts to remove it from tilled soil has also gained uh, Osrodon the nickname Farmer's Sorrow. It can be burdensome as weed, but its medically value is significant. Its beguiling and sweet azure shoots are often added to draughts, droughts to alleviate the pain, draughts, or draughts to alleviate the pain from kidney stones. Uh, Azrodon's ground roots, when chewed, diminish the pain of a headache, and healers have noted the plant's therapeutic value in the balancing and restoration of humors. I mean, what well, pipe weed? Known, to, known by many different names, the fragrant herb can be found throughout Middle Earth. Its leaves are commonly dried, cut, and smoked in pipes by humans, hobbits, and dwarves. Because of the weed's popularity as a uh, smoked as a smoked agent, farmers have taken to devoting portions or all of their fields specifically to its growth and tail. The flowers of the pipe weed plant are less in demand and almost bitter tasting, but there is some evidence that these two have some value. Skilled herbalists have just the flowers properly applied can dull pain and inspire the senses. Okay, so it's just like a it's not as great as as Herodon. Well there's more? I I thought I discovered everything. Oh it's oh, one of these. Intel pickups, right. Uh, picked up on main map, you cannot expose weaknesses until you, right. It's worms. Okay, but how will they expose it? Uh. Oh, maybe I have to enter, like, in this mode first. The Wraith mode first. Oh, there's someone coming. To follow an order from a black captain. You'll be pit food for the category. Okay. Enter Wraith mode to locate nearby target. Nearby artifact, okay. Maybe they don't notice me. Oh. These artifacts hold memories of Mordor. Use L and R to look for the memory, and then press X to reveal it. Mordor and Pestle. A remarkable find. This artifact may date back to the Second Age, to the Great Numeranian Incursion, wherein the Dark Lord Sauron willingly fell into captivity. It would likely have been used by a healer to grind roots and herbs in the creation of pulses and... Ugins, 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 ungins, ungins, required to keep an army hale and relatively heart healthy. Do we not have mortar and pestles? Use R to find memory point. I have lived Crap. my life on the boundary of Mordor, thinking it was dead. Got in the middle of me executing your friend. Just let me kill him first. Okay. An archer. Oh, come on! I just wanted to grab an artifact. Let's go. Ah. No, I have not been grabbing people. Snatched him right out! Overwhelming! Ah! Yeah, I just hit him. I'll kill you! Oh, crap! Oop. 
Oop, did not want to enter self. Good. Ah, oh, finally. Collect arrows. Arrows. Here's store your elf shot. Okay, where do I collect arrows? Oh, I see arrows. Over that way. is the best trainer there is. I think we needed to Nifredil. The sm small flowering plant Nifredil had may have been born of magic in Middle Earth's distant past. Its appearance is indeed otherworldly. Seen from a distance, a patch of its pale white flower blooms and flowers in bloom will appear to be shimmering as the stars do. Med medicinally, nephril flowers, when consumed, function as an agent to soothe the humors and calm a nervous temperament. Its greenish stalks can be crushed and made into a pin thin paste to staunch blood flow. The plant has flourished across Middle Earth and now can be found in even its most inhospitable locales. Okay. Fantastic. Oh, I got upgrades. Fantastic. Alright. Let's see what we can get. Max focus up. Let's get the bow rune shot. Yeah. The slot. Alright. Let's see what we can put. Increase the test on that 25%. Three percent chance to recover, plus 30 focus for a headshot kill. Uh, which one is better? Uh, yeah, I'm not sure. Let's go with this one for now. It's an epic rune, so I'm assuming it's better. How do we find... What was it? Uh... Is it artifacts? Yeah, artifacts. Order and pestle. Use R to find a memory point. Oh, okay. There's some memory. Oh, there it is. The first messengers have rolled into camp. They're reporting few casualties. We've struck a mighty blow against the forces of Mordor aligned against us. Let it be so, and not fools' idle chatter. Hagador, what news? <laughs> They say we won a monumental victory! You'll not be needing all that Athelis you've been grinding, my friend. Few need healing on this day. And more's the wonder. They say the Golden King has brought back a prize. Sauron himself, are in the heavy chains! This is in the Second Age. I don't know who the Golden King is, um, but... Looks like this is when Sauron let himself get captured. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. There's, there's three of them. I can handle three of them. If they go close to the fire, I can shoot the fire. Or I can just do this. Oh, that's what holding me does. Okay. I see some arrows up there, though. Right? There's arrows here? That's what the map says. Uh-uh. You should keep your distance from me. Why? What's your problem? Yes? Can't see the... Oh, they're herbs. That's what that orange thing is. Come to use his sword in a while. That's what. But there's arrows here. I don't see the arrows.
Should be here. I'm so confused. Is there a legend I can view? Uh. Huh. Okay. Well, there's supposed to be arrows right here, but I don't see them. Wait. Ah, legend. Okay. Uh, where's the arrow? I don't see it. What is it? What does it mean? Is it wrong? I guess we'll just forget about it for now. Let's, let's go up here. I came across some strange tracks. No, have it, King. They were made by slaves dragging their feet. I'll shoot the fire, but I can't. Ooh. Can I walk across that? <laughs> the corner masters with Mike and somebody weapons handling <laughs> these broad down to almost nothing. Let's kill the archer. <laughs> oh, I haven't tried attracting yet. I should probably try that. Where's the other one? No, no, just two. I don't see him. Oh well. Oh, there you are. I wanted to grab you real quick. I want to try something. I'm gonna hold you. Okay. Okay, now I can interrogate you. Gain intel. Oh, I can get intel on any of these guys? Select the target for more information to get intel. Uh, I didn't need, already know gain intel to earn... I feel like I already know. Yeah, weaknesses already know. Weaknesses already know, so it's just this guy. Get up the slaver. Yeah, okay. Uh... Can I not gain intel? Well, what's going on? Select the target to learn more information. Yeah, I, I did. What? I'm confused. Oh, unknown captains. Got it. Okay. Well, let's see who's a who's in the front. Hoshu Hothead. Located at Uden Foothills. Angry that other Uruks are so weak and pathetic. I'm sure he's weak to something. Alright. And you are at... Is, is this the new guy? Maku the Blood Hunter. Let's well, intel right here. Let's see what that's about. I can shoot the fire, right? Woo! That was great. That was awesome. Wait, where's the intel? Oh, it was a worm. Did I kill him? I might have fucked up. Yeah. I fucked that up. <laughs> 